like so this is my first haul and it was yesterday when I shopped with I went with my husband and and our baby we took her baby <laughs> but he's not a newborn baby but I did see a lot of babies like newborn and parents took their baby so but our son he's he's 15 months because he was born August 29th of last year and now he's but technically he was born a preemie like a month and a half so really he's like 13 months now but he was a good baby though okay so anyways we went to cvs and the reason why i went to cvs is because the new new makeup from the kardashians came out and i wanted to try it out okay so anyways i'm gonna show you first what i bought so i bought um the maybelline instant age rewind and this one the name of this one is treatment so let me show you um this one it claims this is what it claims it claims to easily erase dark circles puffiness and fine lines so let's say for instance that you have those things right well this one is the neutralizer so what i did is i put it underneath my eyes right because i have i don't have puffiness but I do have dark circles. So I put this before my um, concealer. Because um, my concealer from MAC is the one that I use is the MAC Pro Longwear. And I noticed that it does conceal. It's just that I want it. If you want to do an extra step, this is what I recommend buying this one. And this is number 50 neutralizer. So basically, it has this. Uh, sponge on top and all you do you just click it right and the product comes out and then you just go underneath your eyes and what I do is I blend it with my hands and on top of that after this step you do your concealer and that's what I did so and it has a lot of product so I'm I'm happy there was they did have the concealer be besides this one this is just the um, a treatment kind of that's what I describe it as a treatment before your concealer so and let me show you the price now this one was $9.99 yeah this was $9.99 but it's a good product and it has a lot of it too so okay the next product I'm going to talk about is the Ame One Coat Get Up and Grow now this is a mascara hold on I don't think you can see there you go I got it in black is black yeah and it's a big brush there you go you can see it right there I like that you can create like you this mascara this one this mascara does it lengthens it separates and it can create either natural to your lashes it can make it natural or you can layer it up and it can create those dramatic false lashes like for us like that's what it does i love this product and this was the first time i actually tried an Almay mascara because i never tried one before because my the normal one that i used um is the um, the l'oreal but they didn't have any other one that i wanted because i wanted to try the new one and they only had a waterproof and i didn't want to try the waterproof so let me tell you how much this one cost this one was 8.79 which is which is a good price for a mascara because the l'oreal mascaras those are i love l'oreal it's just that they're more expensive than this one so i wanted to try something new and i love it so there you go okay the next product i'm going to talk about is now the makeup that i was telling you about the, um, the kardashians now i'm gonna do a full-on review and swatches in my next video after this one okay so i'm just gonna show you this one is it's a dual right here it has a lip liner a lipstick and the gloss now the kardashians are known for their new lip kim is known for her new lip so they created um this one and if you want to know the name of it is kardashian chroma that's the name of it it says courtney kim chloe chroma beauty and this one the name of it is in nude that's the name of it i don't know if you can tell i put it closer there you go in the nude and it's, it's pretty 
I think it's pretty. And this one cost it, if anybody's wondering, at my CVS. Hold on. I have a receipt right here. This one costed... $15.49. So it's a little pricey, but if you think about it, you're getting a lip liner, a lipstick, and a lip gloss. Okay, so it's pretty. I'm excited to do swatches on that. Okay, the next one that I got of the Kardashians uh, makeup line was this one. And this is a palette. This is an eyeshadow palette. Now, the sisters, each sister has their own palette. Kim has her smoky eye palette. Chloe has her more neutral palette. And also, Courtney has a more um, palette too, a, a warm palette. And the problem that I noticed was that when I went to my CVS, they had the Kim and the Chloe, but they didn't have the Courtney. And if they would have had the Courtney, I would have bought the Courtney because um, I love her makeup. And it shows you right here. I'm going to put it real close for you guys to see. And it comes with four eyeshadows that are matte and four eyeshadows that are shimmery. And then it has, uh, in the palette, it has the um, highlight, the blush, and the contour, which is like a bronzer. So, yeah, I'm going to do a review about this. The one thing I noticed too in my CVS, they didn't have the mascara. They also didn't, I don't know if it was sold out. I think it was sold out. And then they they didn't have the eyeshadow duo that I wanted with the, um, I'm scratching myself, with the lashes. So, yeah, I was bumped out about that one. And this palette was, before I forget, because I'm talking a lot, this was $13 with 29 cents. So, Okay, now the last thing that I got at CVS, well, yeah, that I, that I got was this one. I always wanted to have, it comes in the back. It's the Conair mirror, and it has lights in it. Now, the old version of this one was mirror in the middle and two mirrors on the sides, right? Now, this one is only one. This is the newer version. And I went to their website, Conair.com. Now, I didn't get it on their website. I went to CVS, but I read re good reviews about it. So that's the reason why I got it. And it has like this, this dial-up tone <laughs> where it says off, evening, home, office, and day. So you can switch up the the lighting when you do your makeup. So I love, I love this one because this is going to be a good addition for me to have in my vanity table. And I already told my husband what vanity table I want. So, yeah. And I'm going to do... I'm going to try it out at home first, and then I'm going to do a review about this one, about the Conair. Because, yeah, because I know there's videos too on YouTube, but I want to make sure you guys get to see it, see the review. Okay, and this, that one was, if anybody's wondering, in my CVS there were only two left, and I got one of the last ones. I guess it's a popular one. And this was $31.99. Now, everything that I got was not on sale. But CVS did have things on sale for... They had a three-day sale for Thanksgiving, Black Friday, and for today. That's why I'm uploading this video because maybe you guys can go to CVS. They had, I think it was, buy four M&M packs for $10. Like, the m and if you're into that. They also had a big box of chocolates. <laughs> that was $29.99 and it went down to $19.99. They had a lot of sales. They had soda for sale. They had, oh, my husband bought the Monopoly game. I have, I'm have. i looking over there because that's where it is. On top over there, my husband put it. Buy one game board, get one for free. Like, they had the toys for sale for, for the kids, for the children. They had buy one, get one free. So they had so many specials. Revlon. If you love Revlon um, lipsticks, they had the Revlon lipsticks. Buy one. Wait, wait, wait. Was it buy one get one? no? It wasn't buy one get one free. It was six. I think it was six dollars or six ninety nine. So it was pretty cheap if you love the lipsticks because usually their lipsticks are like nine ninety nine. I think I'm not sure. I don't remember. And then my husband he bought. I'm showing you the receipt. He bought Pepsi and he bought. What else did he buy? He bought me a Coke, <laughs> Coca-Cola. And that's pretty much it. I mean, yeah. So that's pretty much it. I, we, we didn't buy a lot. Okay, and then 
my husband went to Michael's craft store because I wanted to go in, but the thing is that my our son he was he was sleeping, so I didn't want to wake him up. But eventually he woke up like five minutes after my husband. <laughs> he he went inside the Michael's craft store. So you see that that thing right there, the lights. What is that called? It has a name. Hold on. This is not the bag they gave him, but he put it in this bag. The garland. I'm sorry, I forgot. My husband is good at this. And it's by General Electric. That's the one he got. This one. Oh, man, I left the receipt over there. This one, I think he said he paid 20 I think he said either $10 or $20. I don't remember. But it has a two-year limited guarantee. So and it's clear, so yeah, that's the one he got my husband. And then he also got the command strips, and those are cool. Hold on, let me show you. These are the command strips. If anybody doesn't know, you seen those commercials? Let me show you the packaging too, in case you guys are wondering how does it come. It says command. This one was expensive. I think it was more expensive than the <laughs> than the garland. I think this one he paid twenty or twenty five. I was I was like, what? That's expensive, but they're great. So yeah, and then after there, because we, before we went to Michaels after CVS, we went to the Honey Baked Ham, and because <laughs> we wanted to eat ham, it was closed, so I was sad. <laughs> but we're gonna go buy a Honey Baked Ham for Christmas that's what we want to eat for Christmas because we didn't get the chance to eat ham for Christmas and let's see after we went there we went to Michael's after Michael's we went to Best Buy we wanted to buy a movie like Christmas movies but it was packed it was crazy it was madness everything was on the floor and it didn't look cute it wasn't things were not in order and there were not a lot of um, employees working there so and I told my husband with the baby I don't think so. I'm not going to wait that long. And then after there, we went to Babies or Us, and it was chaotic, too. It was like the line was going like this, like a little snake. Long snake, not a little snake. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, no, that's too long. Let's just go eat. So my husband and I, we went to Soup Plantation, and we ate there. It was delicious. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all we did. We didn't do anything, like, fancy because... He wasn't feeling that well, my husband. He he's he was sick. Yeah. Okay, and I hope everybody's having a good day. And remember, I'm still gonna do video a video a review on the Kardashians makeup line. I didn't pick up the other palette, the Courtney, because it's a smoky palette. And I saw the swatches online, and uh, I wasn't happy with the swatches that I seen online and the and the reviews that I that I heard on YouTube about about it. So that's why I didn't buy it. And I don't wear false lashes unless it's a special special occasion. And even then, because I remember when it was my wedding <laughs> and the makeup artist put my my lashes on, I took them off. Yeah. But they had pretty ones. They had pretty lashes. And they had individual lashes too. The mascara, I was sad. There were no mascaras of the Kardashians anymore. I think it was sold out or it wasn't in the display. It just wasn't in there. And uh, let's see what else. I'm going to do a review about this one too. The Conair. Okay. And please subscribe. <laughs> if you want to see more videos, please subscribe. Because I'm going to do more.